Wow, okay. That music was getting so intense. Hello, good morning. That's a little loud. How you doing, guys? How you doing? Hello. Let me actually close my door, I think, because I don't want to disturb my father. Hello, good morning, Christy, and moocher evening to you. How you guys doing? I have Fruity Pebbles, not a sponsor, but would not be mad if they wanted to sponsor me. So, obviously last night, everything broke, <laughs> so that was fun. Um... But we're gonna we're gonna attempt to to try this again. Waffles, yum. I'm doing okay. Doing pretty good. Got some fruity pebbles. Got some coffee. What's this? Oh, a nice, convenient shortcut. Alright, so let's go down here first, and then we'll do the puzzle. Doesn't this look like... Like, you know how when you're, like, blowing bubbles as a kid? Like, making bubbles? The water kind of has that sheen to it because of the, the glycerin or whatever. Yeah. Hang on right there for me, buddy. I want this. Ooh. Ooh, I want that, though. Um. Oof. I'll throw that away. Okay, I'm back, punies. Don't worry. Let's go. I have three shine sprites so I can power up somebody next time I'm in Rogueport. Alright. La la la. We're getting them across. We're getting them across. Okay. Whoop. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Wisp. Jump. Jump. Cool. Hi guys. <clears throat> we did it. Come on. <laughs> We are gonna switch. Hiya.
They have five. are piters. They just have like a little bit too much HP. But everything's fine. I'm mostly worried about the punies getting scared and me having to go around them back up again. this guy out of the way. So I want that. Haha. <laughs> oh my goodness. This would be the perfect use. You are not going to throw that can on me, stupid X not. This would be the perfect use of a Thunder Rage. So I think I'm gonna use this Thunder Rage. <coughs> dead. That's called dead. 10 star points. check out that, um, this. Ooh! Thank you for the host, Tara. Good morning to ya. Oh, that's what that's called. I think so. Brink! Got him! Come to me, punies. Come to me. Everything is fine. Let us continue. How's it going, Terror? <coughs> Mario, did you see it? That was a jabby. Based on what Puniper said, they're helping the intruders and trying to seize the tree. Our tribes have been enemies for a long time now. <clears throat> and every time we meet, we fight. A lot. But I used to get along with Jabble. He's of the Jabby tribe. 
I wonder if even Jabble is my enemy now. Yes, let's us beat them down. <laughs> Everyone, it's the Jabbies! He's, it's a 10 Jabby squadron. Oh, uh, let's get him. Come on, Mario. You want to get killed? Because that's how you get killed. <laughs> get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Wow, we did it. We defeated every last Jabby here. Now we have to destroy the Jabby Hive Fortress. <clears throat> yeah, I do what? Let's see where he Okay, so we have some puny columns. Okay, we got puny star moon sun. Puny star, moon, sun. Oh, you asked a question to the jabbies I was answering for them. What was the question? I don't remember. Got a blue key! Yes, with this key, we should be able to open the cell with... Oh, that's not... Oh, let me start over. Because that's not flurry talking. Do you want to get... No! No! Yes, with this key, we should be able to open the cell my people are locked in. Hurry, we have to free my sister and the others. No. <laughs> la, 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 we're walking over here. <clears throat> and they'll never come back, and that's what, and that's that, and that's what's gonna happen to us, and... Hey, by the way, what's that thing you've been holding on to so tightly? It's a mushroom! Oh, not to be, you know, rude, but it looks all dry and wrinkly and gross. Yeah, yeah, I know. I picked it so I could give it to my brother to eat. But then I got captured and stuck in here, and after a few days it dried out. Oh, really? Great story. Anyway, don't worry too much. All my complaining aside, I'm sure Puny will return. Nah, well, that's that, I guess. <laughs> so, I think what I'll do... Is I'm going to continue to explore as much as I can before I have the hu all of the punies with me. Because um, it'll just make things easier, I think. End of chapter. Mario just flat out refused to rescue puties. Let's move on, I guess. <laughs> right? So I don't know, Terror. Oh, sweet. I don't know, Terror, if you can hear it or if I'm just doing a bad job, but um, can you hear my Chopper esque inspired voice for Punio? We're gonna stay while we're here. Okay, I'm glad you remembered. Look at this guy. <clears throat> the shop is hard to spot, so I've been in here hiding from those goons this whole time. But those fiends have been searching high and low for something inside this tree. What could they have been looking for? You have any idea? No. Howdy do that day, bud. Welcome to Pungent Shop. What can I do you for? I need to store. Let's see, you can store up to 29 more items, bud. Want to store everything? Okay, we're storing the end coupon. Don't need that right now. Yes. <clears throat> I'm also going to store my ultra shrooms because I don't need those this early. Just, if anybody can try to remind me that I have ultra shrooms uh, stored, that would be great. Hmm, hmm. I think an ice storm could be useful, so I'm going to get an ice storm. 
I paid close attention while watching your marathon stream. Oh, thanks. Yeah, my super long marathon stream that definitely was not interrupted in any shape or form. <laughs> okay, what am I doing health-wise? Let's see. Whoops. Mm, it's only eight coins. Might as well. Thanks, Christy. I appreciate that. Okay. <clears throat> We're gonna keep moving along. I think I'm gonna want coops for this. <clears throat> Man. <clears throat> Low Flemmy. <laughs> I watched She's the Van the other day with my parents. It was fun. I'm probably gonna get them scared, but you know. Yep, there they go. Ugh. There we go. Power smash! Power shell! Got him. Ugh. Ugh. Can't wait till I level up my sweet, sweet jump. Oof. It's hard to tell, you know, like, where they're gonna shoot. The stream was pretty long last night. Had to take a couple breaks to get through it. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. It was just, you know, probably the longest stream I've ever done to date. So, I totally understand, you know, you gotta take a break, you gotta be like, oh, I gotta look at something else for a little bit, you know, take a walk, maybe take a nap, get some food, yeah, I mean, I totally get it. Hi, punies. Puniper is one of my favorite punies because he's just so big that his eyes are even, like, squinched shut. <laughs> like, there's that 12 hour, then there was that! Oh, I know. Okay. This is an impossible sort of situation for a platformer like me, but, you know, sometimes you're just a pro. <laughs> Alright, come on. Okay. Ugh, four. What we got? I don't want to use that quite yet. Let's use a special. I'm not good at this, so here we go. okay at <laughs> the uh, timing we're fine got him let me do one more of these suckers get two of them out thank you thank you thank you I'm glad you like it I was just like you know I'm trying to like come up with good voices for everybody in this playthrough and um I was like, crud, what am I going to do? Let's appeal. You know, for, like, I didn't want to just be, like, generic kid voice. I wanted to give him a little bit more, like, specific of a sound. 
So that's why I decided to try to emulate Chopper's voice. Especially because, like, Chopper and, and Punio both are, like, small, but they're, like, not afraid. And, <clears throat> you know, they care about their people. And, you know, they want to do good. So that's why I felt like it was it was fitting. I'm here. Whoa! Almost ran right off the side. Okay, we can't go in there yet because we don't have enough punies. It'll just be a massacre. So we're gonna go back and get the rest of the punies. The Steve defense, aka taking punches right to the face from Billy. It's true. Stranger Things Season 3, coming at you in like two weeks. I'll probably rabbit it, but it may have to be a couple days after. I don't want to tell anybody that they can't, obviously can't watch it when it releases, but I'm going to have um, lots of family in town for 4th of July. Um, I'll be... Uh, Sarah and Robert are coming back into town as well as my uncle Dan and his girlfriend Andrea So I'm just gonna have a lot going on 4th of July, and I don't know if even I'll be able to watch it until later the Most important thing happening in that span of time is stranger things season 3. No, no, it's not the most It is just one of Uh, which way was the, I think, this way? Yeah. <sighs> Father's Day's tomorrow, y'all. Be good to your dads. Also, another big event is happening. But I don't know if you want me to share priv share on stream. So you gotta tell me. Petunia, I'm back! We brought the key! We're opening the cell right now! Gesture, that's all. Oh, I was nothing. Ninety punies have joined your party. Now there are a hundred and one. <laughs> all right, so now we have a hundred and one punies to take care of. No pressure, though. Petunie, that mushroom was poisonous. <laughs> All right. La la la. 
see, I kind of like being the, like the... We're following the leader, the leader, the leader, to over a hundred punies. It's fun. Uh, down here. Oh! Should we talk to the elder? Maybe we should talk to the elder. Being the Captain Olimar to the puny Pikmin, yeah. I've played some Pikmin, but it definitely stresses me out. And whenever Pikmin get killed, I feel like trash. I love you! Well, I'm shocked! Who makes fun of an old woman like that, honestly? Well, if I were just ten years younger, I'd show you. Oh, you best believe it. I'll have you know that in my younger days, I was considered a puny prize. I had so many suitors, I had to fight them off. <laughs> now that I think about it, there was a particularly fine boy named Punderton. I got yelled at by people watching me when I played Pikmin and so. See, the pressure's just too high. I, I, I can't, I could, I could never stream Pikmin, like, heck no. Two hours later. And that's how I became the puny elder, the leader of the puny tribe. Now you know my tale, and I know yours, so good luck to you. Mm-hmm. I should probably heal. Okay, um, if you want to stream Pikmin, then how will I see Pikmin on Twitch? I don't know, buddy. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> okay. Ah, shoot. I forgot. Dang it. I need to take this off. Life ruined. Oh, oh man, I am a life ruiner. I guess you'll just have to stream Pikmin yourself. <sighs> I know, it's a shame. Is that all of them? Cool. Yeah! Got him! Okay, uh, we're going this way now. Oh. Oh. Uh, die. Okay. <clears throat> do -do 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 -do. It's fun, like, seeing the huge train of punies. La la la. And see, I defeated all the enemies so that I wouldn't have to do that with a group of a hundred punies. It's much easier to take care of them when you have only ten. I don't want to stress you out by playing Pikmin on stream, so I can't even do that. No, no, no. I'm saying it's stressful to play Pikmin. Because I, fe because I put such a personal responsibility on myself for the deaths of Pikmin. No, like I've, I've watched Chugga Conroy play Pikmin just fine. I just, when I tried to play it, I was like, Oh no, they're dead! That was basically me. Look at all the jabbies. It's the jabbies. <sighs> it's a 100 jabby squadron. Uh, charge! Come on, Mario. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Take that. Get him. Get him. Get him. Well, we beat him. We KO'd every last jabby here! Now let's destroy the jabby hive fortress!
Pear version? Probably better than chug a version. How about them apples? Hmm? How about that? We did it! Bye! <laughs> More Emonies. I don't know if we're gonna test it. I don't know if uh if Flurry's any good at this or if she's gonna get chomped. Yep, okay, cool. Sounds like a baseless bold claim. Wow. I don't appreciate being called a liar. <laughs> Let's swap out, um, for coops. Dang it! All right, coops, finish him off. Got him. You're right. I could be right. And I should be proved right on the internet. Best Mario game, Mecha! Mecha, fun fact. I don't know if you remember this. But I met you when you were playing this game. Because I was searching for people playing Thousand Year Door at the time. And you were live, and that's how I met ya. So, this is the game that brought us together. <laughs> how are you doing? Good morning. Thank you for shouting out Mecca. <clears throat> we're gonna try this again when I don't fail at timing. I'm in tears right now. I know. It's so wonderful. <laughs> How you doing? How's your Saturday going? How was your week? <laughs> Sweet reunion. I know, right? Boop! <laughs> That's the noise that Coops makes when he hits things. Boop! <laughs> yeah, so this is- I'm obviously going through my, uh, second favorite- Second favorite level in my favorite GameCube game of all time. So, you know, having a great Saturday mornings. I got addicted to Dauntless. Now I'm getting ready for work. Rip. I have to go to work later, so I feel ya. It was fun while it lasted, right? Your morning. <laughs> um... Uh-ohs. He boops the piranha plants on the nose-like area with his shell at high speed. Oh, what? What? What just happened? <laughs> Man, you guys are dense. Brilliant little trap, huh? And boy, did you bite on it. I saw you sticking that silly stone on the pedestal, so I made a fake one. Awesome. I mean, I knew it was great, but seeing you fall for it really gives me a warm fuzzy. <laughs> Talk about complete idiots. You guys are so dumb, it hurts. Anyway, with you fools out of the picture, I can take my time hunting the crystal star. <laughs> what is Dauntless? What kind of game is that? I don't think I've heard of it. Mario, what do we do? We, uh, we have to find a way out of here. But what can we do? You guys stay there. Y'all chill for a bit. I'll be back. Boy, this just isn't right. Let's do something before my claustrophobia sets in. Mario, think of something. I'm counting on you. Let's go. 
It's a free-to-play Monster Hunter-like game. Okay, cool. Wait, you see those? I'm pretty sure I've seen columns like those before. Yeah, I know. It, oh, crud, what was the... Oh, crud, what was the solution? Puny... Star... Puny Star Moon Sun? Puny Star Moon Sun? Huh? Whoa, whoa, whoa. The tree just shook. What was it, an earthquake? Um... Oh, this is the order I need. Okay. Sun, moon, puny star. Sun, moon, puny star. Sun, moon, puny star. It's like the Pokemon games with a puny and a star. Okay. Um, hang out there, guys. Sumo pussed. Why couldn't the later Paper Mario games be like that? I know! I cry when I think about it. <laughs> I mean, what I was really hoping for at this year's E3 announcements was Paper Mario for Switch! And we're going back to this format. Um... Where was that other- oh, it's over here. Gets banned. No, I mean, I, I don't ban people for their wrong opinions. <laughs> okay. Cool. Okay. Sun, moon, puny star. Sun. Moon. Puny. Star. Got him. I would even take a port of this game. Nintendo, please! I know. Same. Wouldn't it be great to have, like, an HD remaster of this game? Super boots! That means my my stomps won't be so weak. Hey there, I'm Toadette. Congratulations on getting the super boots. These cool kicks power up jump attacks. And you'll be able to use a new technique. So let's practice it, okay? <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Hope you're doing well this Saturday. I would total Yeah, this paper looks so good HD would be like legit what I'd say. I would totally buy in a heartbeat. If you press A at the right moment when jumping, you'll do a spin jump. Timing is everything. Watch me. Yes! Pro. Wow, that was perfect. Oh, look at her little blush. You're a natural. Wanna try again? Okay, that's just super. Looks like you've mastered the spin jump. You can smash through spots like this with your spin jump. Got it. That's it! You got it! You can use the spin jump in battle, too! Give it a try! Well, I hope to see you again soon! Good luck on your adventure! Bye! Cool. Let us test. Ooh, buddy! Um... Get him. I did, Christy. I did. It made this girl very happy. Oop. B. <laughs> I'm happy. Toadette would later go on and be a craft master in Paper Jam. Oh, cool. I still haven't played Paper Jam yet. Let's try this again. Let's try this again. <laughs> cool. 
Jump! Oh my freaking! <laughs> I could press the button. Toadette? Well, I'm just in time to see the worst character. Wow! Wow, G. Sorry, Toadette fans. I like Toadette. She'd a bomb. Um, how you doing? Are you able to actually see this today? Do you have eyes on this stream or just ears? Did Toadette get, just get lost in the redwood forest? There's so much shade. Okay, um... Crud, where am I going? Okay. I keep forgetting where I am in the tree. I'd love to see the redwood forest in Cali one day. Thank you! Thank you! Considering he just claimed to see Toadette, he is either very delayed or basing his claim on my text in your audio. I'm glad you like my V-Budkey logo. I appreciate that. What is down here? Oh, okay, we'll come back. Thank you, thank you. My layout was made by Oscar, uh, the my friend Mr. So Far Gone 516. Shout outs to Oscar for making this cool layout for me. All right. All right, fam, let's go. Thank you for shouting out Oscar. Who was talking to me? <clears throat> Whoa, sick! I know, right? I'm, you know, basically a pro streamer with, like, fancy layouts. I'm just kidding. <laughs> that was a nice thing to do to those people. Alright, let's try to recenter these guys. Cool. Get in the hole! That's not true. Didn't Oscar make your layout too terrible? Okay. Got him! Let's go, fam. Let's go. How's your Saturday morning going, Garrett? It's good to see ya. It's good to see your text in the place. Alright, we're gonna try this. We gotta do this again. Whoops, wrong way. It says there's one puny. Where's the puny? What the heck? Oh, they're all here. Okay, what the heck? Oscar pretty good at making the layouts. Here we go. Tick dirt. Big jump to the face. Yes, look at that powered up jump. I kind of garbaged up my other layouts in short amount of time. What do you mean? I don't think you've ever had a garbage layout. Oh, 
go, let's go. Plow. Oh. Kaploop. I can't even avoid that. More power! All right, well, how about a nice big fat jump to the head? I think my one layout was Yoshi eating cookies, the chat and the game. Uh, Yoshi eating cookies is fantastic. Kabow! That's exactly, exactly what we just did. Dang it. These things. <laughs> no, I was, I was kapowing along with Christie's kapow. Yoshi eating cookies was all I needed, right? Exactly. Oof. These things. You win at punch no. <sighs> I'm just a bad internet person. I'm the c person that your parents warned you about on the internets. It was like promotional art from Yoshi's Cookie. Is Yoshi's Cookie a... a game? I'm the person your parents warned you about. In general! Like, hey, look out for the really nice people. They're just everywhere. <laughs> These stinking... <sighs> Yuxes. <sighs> all right, all right, dead. It's a puzzle game. Okay. Cool. I've never even heard of it. What what platform was it for? 64? Get in the money. Money, money, money! NES. Okay. Neat. My mom always told me not to hang out with incredibly awesome people. <laughs> yeah, mine too, totally. What is this? What is happening here? I really don't want you guys to drown, so could you all come up the stairs, please? Punies. Gather round. Now we go up the stairs. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Okay. Come on. All right. Cool. Now you guys stay here. Completely flobble. <sighs> okay. I hope they don't drown. <clears throat> and yet here you're with V. What a rebel. <laughs> Some might call me a bad boy. Oh, okay. Hang on. I know how to do this. <laughs> Whoa! I just flushed coops down the drain. I hope I'm not drowning any beauty. <laughs> 
That would be unfortunate. So what else is down here? Hey, look, a thing! Shrink stomp. Okay, cool. Nobody drowned. Neat. Let's go slowly across. Carefully, fam. Carefully. No puny left behind. Oh, oh, right. Me and the big guy of North are cool with each other. Oh, I mean, that's good. You know, you don't want to get coal in your stocking. <clears throat> that's not where I meant to go. I wanted to go down. So that's how you get to this room. You removed the puny orb. Um, they give you a save block right here, so I'm trying to figure out if that means that, uh, we about to have a showdown. I don't remember exactly, but we're gonna, we're gonna heal and save just, just cause. Just cause that sounds like a good idea. I'm so glad that they fixed Twitch, by the way. <laughs> I'm, I, you know, you gotta be ready for showdowns. You gotta be. <clears throat> hmm, let me see. That thing's gotta be around here somewhere. What, what voice did I give him? Rank your favorite par Paper Mario games in order. Okay, here we go. Uh, The Thousand Year Door is number one for me, my favorite. Uh, Followed by original Paper Mario. So Paper Mario 64. Uh, third favorite is going to be Color Splash. Uh, fifth would be Super Paper Mario. And last would be Sticker Star. <clears throat> uh -huh, what's that? Whoa, sounds like a mob. Better clear out. How, where did I, did I, how did I lose 30? Where are all my punies? What are you guys doing? <laughs> and hello, it's nice to meet you, Blood Lover. Hope you're having a great day. I like to check all the bushes because, you know, you might find treats. Thousand Year Door is definitely my favorite. I think it's the best one. Okay, um... Alright. Put the orb on. <clears throat> Hope you're having a good Saturday. Mario, look! 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 It's the crystal star! What? Did he just... Hey! What's going on here? <laughs> Man, am I lucky or what? Or am I just good? Oh, you say you need a crystal star, little crumb? Boom! Falls right in my lap! <laughs> <clears throat> Still, this is humiliating. You shouldn't have been able to escape that cell. So for insulting my awesome trap, I'm gonna repay you with a little present. You know what it is? Oh, just a little something I like to call a remote time bomb detonator. <clears throat> I 
I'm gonna use this to bury you and no squirmy punies in rubble. Sound fun? We'll enjoy your final minutes inside this dank old tree. Dank. Almost dabbed, didn't know. Haha. -ha. <laughs> and with that pow, I'm gone. All right, so you got 300 seconds to get out of here. Which if somebody wants to do the math, I think that's five minutes. D did he just say, hurry, we have to get the heck out of here. All right, come on, let's go. <laughs> VB dab. Everybody get down. And you have to, <clears throat> I hate that the, the timer keeps going even while you're battling. So let's jump the fleeble flobble out of these guys. <clears throat> I need to see another dab. I don't think you need nothing like that, sir. <laughs> I thought Color Splash was very nice, um, but I might be in the minority. <laughs> Someday over the rainbow, we might have to get on stream. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, press the button. Go. It was. <laughs> I was playing Paper Mario 64 when I dabbed. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I don't remember which way we going. Um, um, this way? Nope! <laughs> I forgot where I was! Oh, did I dab during that stream? I don't remember. Cool. We are in the 100s. <clears throat> Running. I think I think G is right. Oh, no, Riddy did clip the dab on Paper Mario because that's the the one that's ah oh, fleeple flobble. Okay, she did clip the one on Paper Mario because oh, shoot. Ah. Cause that's the clip that I often see. Let's go. Let's go, fam. <clears throat> oh, I take it back, ready. <laughs> yeah, I. She may have clipped both. won't be going any farther this way what are you nuts move it you old geezer what did you just call me an old geezer where do you get off talking like that you got no respect brat don't i like how he's like Pink. don't think my age has anything to do with my might even if it kills me i won't let you through i'm ready elder power activate whoa what's your problem grandma you got an ear hair tickle in your brain or what oh oh what the ouch can't Take another step. Oh, oh, oh. Er. What a time for my stupid back to start acting up. You hot-headed old coot. You dare to find me? I could shine my boots with you. Ahem, you'll do no such thing. Honestly, did you really think we'd let a wretch like you escape? I do believe you'll be handing over that crystal star and promptly exiting this tree. B -b -b you guys are nuts, you know that? Oh well, I guess I better shut off this timer. That's good. I know she isn't here, but always assume she is here. Okay, you pests. One pummelin coming up with extra fists. Metal fists, that is. Oh, see, Tara went and found it for you. Awake, Magnus Vaughn Grapple! Time for a technological thrashing! Enjoy! <clears throat> Alright, cool. So, here we go. Boss fight. This was also caused by the word dank. <laughs> Something about my
my brain when it hears the word dank just thinks you gotta dab. Are you crying yet? Yeah? Sorry, but this thing isn't armed with tissues. Well, Magnus Vod Grapple has that effect on people. Total weeping terror. Aww, terror, don't weep. And you ain't seen nothing yet. Check out the power on this bad boy. Mercy me, that Metal Colossus is incredible. And yet, there's something rather odd about it. Let's just keep our eyes peeled. Don't be careless. Alright. What do we want to do first? Are there any items that could give us a nice little... I, uh, I don't think that's gonna... Oh, Jeez, over here dabbing away. I don't know if that Vault Shroom's gonna do any good. I'm going to start out with this Ice Storm and see how that goes. And hopefully I don't... Nope, you know what? I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Let's just start with a good old Body Slam. Wow. <clears throat> Dang, Tara, I'm sorry I made fun of Toadette. <laughs> yeah. Only three? Here it comes, suckers. Magnus Vaughn punish! She is a pink powerhouse, G. Ow. He must have a defense point. I wonder if my power smash would be better. I think it probably would be. <clears throat> Flurry's only doing one. Gosh. Okay, okay, I'm just weirded out by our hair shrooms. <laughs> um. Dang, this is not great. I wonder if attacking the feet is better. Let's see. Nope, only one damage. Hey, E, how's it going? And it's not my new um, logo, it's just for this layout for this game. How's it going? Good morning. Hope you're doing well. I feel like Koops might be better for this fight. Or maybe even Goombella. Oh, it ain't over yet. This is so awesome. Check out what else this guy can do. You're gonna love it. This might not work out too well for you. Thank you. <clears throat> Alright, now is the perfect time to use this Ice Storm, I think. So we gonna do that. She just didn't dab because I wasn't here. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh okay. <laughs> Ian the house. Um, I will take that. Thank you. Um. We're still doing okay. So. We will most definitely be getting a level up from this, which is good. Let's switch out. Let's switch to... Coops only has 10 HP. Okay, we're switching to Goombella. <clears throat> I just don't think the tree was dank enough. Oh, okay. Is Lord Crump from New Jersey? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes, we're gonna go with that. Dang it. Doctor, it needs to be more dank. How are you doing, Outlander? Speak quickly, Outlander. Um, I hope you're doing well today. It's good to have you. Let's do a nice little head bonk. At least that's two, which is more than what Flurry's doing. Grr, ugh, not good, can't last. Um, we're doing all right, we're doing all right. Let's do another power smash. Yes. 
Now this could be a problem. But I don't think I have anything else to handle that. I'm gonna take this honey syrup. I started playing a ROM hack of Mario Galaxy that makes it like 10 times as hard yesterday. Why would you do that miserable thing to yourself? <laughs> I joke. I hope you're in I hope you're having a good time with it. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> oh, that hurt. <laughs> Sorry, Goombella. <laughs> I got to, I got to bingo. Guys, I love this game. I love this game so much. Okay. We are gonna do a nice little head bonk to take out Magnus. That's it, fam. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, this could be the end. <laughs> All right, so I did badge points last time, so we're going back to HP. Magnus von Grapple! How could we lose? <sighs> I'll remember this, losers. <laughs> Beauty great at Fortnite. She's dancing after she just murdered that robot. Lord Crump summons us! Retreat, retreat, heads up, wait up, run away! Does the whip and nay nay <laughs> We did it, Mario, yes. Was that great or what? They're gone. This place can go back to being the peaceful place I remember. All right there, Mario. You can have the Emerald Star, the crystal star that resided in this tree. Oh, thank you. A Goofy movie is my favorite uh, animated movie, so I do like the power line shirts. Gee, that was like 2016. <laughs> is it not still 2016? <clears throat> you got a crystal star! And to commemorate, watch this, guys. Ta da! 2016 kids must be very impressed right now. And you learned the special move clock out. <clears throat> I'm still impressed, G. End of chapter! Thank you, thank you, thank you. And so, after pummeling Lord Crump, Mario ob obtained the second crystal star. With the X-Nots gone, peace once again prevailed throughout the Great Tree. The Bogley Woods echoed with the puny songs of joy. But this may not be the last our, he our hero hears from the vile X-Nots. They will surely continue to stand in Mario's way and try to put a stop to his efforts. <clears throat> yes. All right, you guys ready for the best part of this game, which is the in-between the chapter parts? <laughs> Let's see, who shall we visit? Oh, okay. What? Say that again. You can't get in touch with Lord Crump. You are correct, sir. We are investigating now. We should hear any time. Sir Grotus, please allow me to enter. <clears throat> I have a report, sir. The Crystal Star in the Bogley Woods has apparently been taken by Mario. What? You must be joking. What about Lord Crump and the Shadow Sirens? I'm sorry, sir. Unfortunately, Mario laid a beating on all of them. Hmm. Disturbing. This Mario character, what kind of... Speak up, x not. What is the status of the other Crystal Stars? I apologize, sir. We are still searching for the other Crystal Stars. Unsuccessfully, sir. We know of three of them. Hotel Castle, Bogley Woods, the one we got in Rogueport. 
That means there are four crystal stars left out there. And we will have them. Keep looking so that Mario won't beat us to the punch. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Is it time? I don't, I actually don't have a give command. I need to figure out how to do that so that you guys can move tickets at your will. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't have that set up. The X knots have speech impediments. I'm just trying to give every character a different voice. So I'm like <laughs> grasping at straws sometimes. As I suspected, there's no reason to doubt that Mario has that map. He must. Listen up, you. I want you to keep a close watch on what Mario does from now on. Absolute. Absolutely, sir. I forgot what voice I gave him. Mario, I loathe you. Oh, Mario, did you even read the mail I sent you? I wonder. I wonder so many things. I wonder how everyone is doing at the castle. Will I never dance at the mushroom ball again? What will become of me? All right, cool. So we're, at, we're Peach now. Shall we take another shower? We should. <clears throat> oh, is this text doing again? Thank you, Outlander. We're gonna take a shower because this place is gross. Nobody will mind if I take a quick rinse. Oh, she sent an email. Um, the te the computer tech, he let her send an, send an email to uh, Mario. She is having too much fun. I mean, don't you have tons of fun getting clean, showering? How refreshing. I feel like a new princess. See, why can't she hang on to this? I like the cute little ponytail, but then as soon as you leave the room, her hair's down. Like, what the heck? Why didn't she keep the ponytail in? It was cute. Okay. Let's go see what Tech wants. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. Okay. Hello, Princess Peach. I am glad you came. That mail I sent to Mario, did it reach him all right? Yes, I can confirm that Mario received the mail. Is that so? Well, good. So what do you want from me today? Is there more you want to know of love? Re-release the game with the ponytail? I mean, that's what, that's the dream, right? <clears throat> you expressed regret earlier that you would not be able to dance at a ball, correct? Excuse me? Were you eavesdropping? I just took a shower. Stop it, Tara. <laughs> I am sorry, Princess Peach. I have been ordered to keep surveillance on you. But it is odd. When you said that, I had an impulse to dance with you as well. How my CPU would produce this impulse is inexplicable. I must find what caused it. Find out what caused it? There's no reason behind such a feeling, Tech. Wanting to do something together, it's part of love. I know it. But then again, you are, well, a computer. Dear Reggie. <laughs> Reggie! Although, I like Doug Bowser, so I can't be too sad. <clears throat> he said this is the best part of the game. I just mean... <laughs> I just mean, like, I like that they include, like, what Peach is up to during all of this. Princess Peach, please dance with me. Wait, 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 wait just a minute. What... Am I supposed to do? You say you want to dance? It's just so bizarre. I mean, how in the world can I dance with you? You have no arms or feet or moves. Oh, look at the shade. Tech got no moves. <clears throat> this robot creeping on Peach shower and dis the face. 
Thank you for, uh, that. <laughs> Would this be an acceptable dance substitute? Oh my goodness! Is that me? Did you create that? Oh, alright, I guess. I must say, though, it's gonna feel weird dancing with myself. Press the buttons as they display on the screen. Okay. We're gonna be the best dancers. Whoops. Dang it! This is so dank. <laughs> dancing up with myself. Oh, 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 I'm dancing with myself. <laughs> moves. I have moves, princess. <laughs> Not creepy at all. <clears throat> Thank you, Princess Peach. That was very fun. Just a moment. Fun? Is this impulse I feel the concept? Is this impulse I feel the concept known as fun? Tech, are you okay? <clears throat> Princess Peach, I will fulfill my promise to you. Please use my communicator. Use the keyboard to send whatever message you want. I'm finished, Tech. Could you send it? The message has been sent. Please go back to your room. I want to analyze the data from this dance immediately. The data that I thought was fun. <clears throat> but everybody wants to dance with you always, so you don't have the time to dance with yourself. True. We would kill it at the competitions. Wouldn't that be cool? Everybody would think you are like twins, but it's actually just you twice. That'd be cool. You're a weird computer. No, you are mistaken. I am the world's best and only perfect computer. Wow, ego trip. Good night, Princess Peach. Okay, so we gotta save the dance, obviously. If I could make clones, life would be easy. Right, but then at the same time, it's like, gosh, you gotta feed yourself twice, you know. I feel like it could get expensive, but if you had the money, like, you could just be so productive. Garrett clone jutsu. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's just up ahead here. Right as usual, Lord Bowser. We just got word that Princess Peach was spotted in the town up ahead. Good, yes, very good. Then I'm off. These fools don't know what's coming. My, my lord, you're so super. Oh, ah, ah. I don't think that's moral. Okay, here we go. We got some classic platforming. We also have some fire through the fire and flames. Want this. Yes, big. Getting some coins. Give me, no! I want this. If you just sit still, then Bowser can't get Peach. Dun, dun, dun. It would take a long time for my class. Super Bowser Bros! Finish! Oh, hey, welcome to Petalburg and... Eek! Hide, everybody, hide! <clears throat> what a wuss. Yes, hide, chickens. I have no need for any of you. 
What do I- what I do need, though, is Princess Peach. Now, where is she? Tell me this instant. V could end it all. No more Mario games. Lord Bowser, over there! Bingo, Princess Peach. Man, that was easy. I found you, my princess. I, Bowser, the mighty Koopa King, offer my greeting. She's like... <laughs> you sounded like the finish from the original Mario Party just then. That was the goal. I'm glad I sounded, like, close enough to it. Now, now, none of that silent treatment. You're coming to my castle with me. <laughs> Clearly she's just so overcome with joy that she's been left speechless. The mind of a maiden is, well, rather complicated. <laughs> <laughs> I see, I see. How refined, how elegant, awesome! I suppose I could live with a silent princess. It might even have its perks, you know? No! My, my life's a treasure! I'd rather die than give up my life-size peach poster! <laughs> Why are you hanging your poster on the outside of your house? The poster? Oh my goodness me, didn't see that coming. <laughs> great, just great. Now I look like the huge mighty king of guys who talk to posters. <laughs> Poor Bowser. Like, there. Uh, another reason I love this game is that you, you feel a little bit of sympathy for Bowser at times. Like, he just really likes Peach and... <laughs> Poor guy, can't catch a break. Been that king before? Oh, the king of talk of guys who talk to posters. Which posters were you talking to? I'm curious. Cause he wants people to think Peach is his girlfriend. Yeah, like he just, you know. <laughs> Roar! There is a glacion roaring at me. Oh. Hey, how's it going, Mystic? Uh, thank you, Mario, for everything you've done. We can go back to our peaceful way of life now. You know, son, now that we are right down to it, I'm kind of sad to see you go. I do love pontificating. Pontificating? So come on by whenever you want to sit and chat a while. Yes, please come back and visit. We'll watch for you. We'll work together from now on to prevent anything like that from happening again. Thanks for showing us how to stick together, Mario. Good luck with the crystal stars. Oh, I'm sure we'll be back again at some point. Yeah, definitely. Take care, guys. See you, Mr. Mario. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Glaceon used Roar. V force forcibly switched out. <gasps> Mom, you gotta come stream. <laughs> dad, take your controller. <laughs> My dad would be like... He'd sit down and be like... Um... <laughs> I do that all the time. That's why there's a pic of Nancy in my window. One day I'm going to get my dad to stream with me. It'll probably be something like Mario Kart or something. like, Or even Jackbox. Because my dad has played Jackbox with me before. But I think that would be funny. Okay. Um, Alright, back to Rogueport. <clears throat> Let's take in all the sights and sounds of Bogley Woods as we leave. Music, oh. This was interrupted. Hey, you hear that? Someone's mailing you. Yes, thank you for shouting out, Mystic. Dear Mario, I'm sure you're very concerned about me. But please know I'm fine. I'm actually more worried about you. The fiends who kidnapped me are searching desperately for the crystal stars. I'll try to learn what I can about them. I'll email again if I uncover anything, okay? You must know I miss you. Lately I've dreamt about our days back in the castle. <clears throat> v looking like she do when she's relaxing and sees a call from work. Exactly. I hope we'll spend carefree days there again soon. 
Princess Peach. Aw, oh, isn't that sweet, Mario? Mm-hmm. He's like, mm-hmm. Spin jumps. I do. I love I love Boggly Woods a lot. Let's see if there's any other mail that I need to open. Nope. Okay. <clears throat> I guess I just get to keep the puny orb, like, even though I'll never need it again. No! Kafleeble. And, uh, Gumbella's basically useless in this fight, so cool. <clears throat> Yoshi! Let's just defend. Got him. A shame, but I needed to slightly extend my jump. I mean, we, we get it. We understand. Okay. I'm gonna break into this. Y'all want some... Oh, floop. Alright, a little bit of ASMR coming at you. Ready? I'm gonna open a can for you. Maybe just run away, because I don't want to deal with this. TBH. G as second player. Dang, he's too good at this game. I guess I'll never get a turn. <laughs> Aww. Alright. What is here? Also, ASMR. <laughs> when I used Super Mario Maker on stream and had viewers submitted levels, someone designed a level entirely around sacrificing Yoshi jumps to make it to the end. I'm sorry, G. Okay, um... I think I have to, uh, you know what? I don't think I have to talk to, I'm trying to think. I don't think I have to talk to, um, ooh. What is his name? Frankly, before. So we're just gonna go ahead and put the uh, star on the pedestal. Like bring it to the door. In lava, no less, so he can't flutter jump to save his life. Aww. Poor Yoshis, yeah. Alright, cool. Now, my little Mario, it's crystal star time! What is the next location? Of our next star. That's true, Terror. Are you gonna give us some Super Mario Maker 2 streams? Oh, thank you, Outlander, for that follow. I appreciate that. Ooh. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Hang on a second, wait a second. Hang on. I need to check something. Outlander. I have to thank you twice because you are my 700th follower. 7th, 700th follower. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Um, I hope you're having 
a great time hanging out and we hope we get to see you again but thank you so much for being my 700th follower another milestone hit i really appreciate that 700th not seventh <laughs> my seventh follower 700th follower okay the location of a crystal star has been recorded on your magical map cool <laughs> oh mercy me the next crystal star has made an entrance my 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 but correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't it up in the sky? What does that mean? Hmm. Thank you, guys. That means that beneath this town, the thousand-year door remains intact. Ruins remain intact. And that door has been sealed shut by its four thousand years by the crystal stars. In order to open that seal, we have to muster the power of all the crystal stars. Perhaps I'm just daft, but why would they want to seal this treasure away at all? Do they fear the thieves and brigands? If not, then what? No, that's not. Hmm? That's not what? I don't know! <laughs> right? Frankly, please. I'm sorry. So sorry. I know that the treasure was sealed away around the time the town was destroyed. But the problem is, no one's even sure what it was that caused the town's demise. All that's written is this. Darkness stole the sky and the cataclysm rained down. I must research this more. Assuming you will make an... Well, you know the saying. Oh yes. How inappropriate. In any case, what's th what about the location of this crystal star that's floating on the map? Hmm, very interesting. Perhaps it's pointing to the floating town of Glitzville. There's a stunning arena where the great warriors engage in furious battles. That's a perfect frankly voice. Thank you, Samurai. <laughs> How are you doing today? Ostensibly, families go there on vacation to lounge and enjoy the flight. Not the flights. The fights, but behind the scenes, the richest people in the world wager on the bouts. A floating city, you say? So are we just supposed to sprout wings and fly there, darling? Do tell. A special blimp flies there. It departs from Rogueport several times a day. The problem is getting a seat. The only way to get a ticket is through certain channels. Enjoying some tea and some good streams. Thank you. I hope your tea's fantastic. Oh, that sounds exciting. A little on the seedy side. Show me the way. Hmm, I don't know. But I guess we don't have much choice. Word on the street is all tickets go through Don Pianta on the west side. Head west from Rogueport's main plaza and you'll reach the west side of town. That part of town is under the control of Don Pianta, the Pianta Syndicate head. Apparently, Don Pianta makes pretty regular jaunts over to Glitzville. Hmm, I like the sound of this Don Pianta fellow. I cannot wait to meet him. It may sound easy, but he's a syndicate boss, folks. The rumors about him are scary. And Don Pianta's a recluse. Just getting an audience with him will be difficult. Okay, cool. Getting some tattles. Okay, cool. Shoving your face full of pretzels. That does sound great. Okay, so as... Oh, we got some mama. Wow, I can speak. We've got some email. I was like... Blah, 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 blah. What's up, Coops? After you found me, Coops, I found a nice hiding nook at a place called Goomstar Temple. It's so cold, my shell is frosty, but it's a great place for hiding. Obviously, I don't want anybody to find me, but the thing is, I do want people to see how good I am at hiding. You see the vine I'm in? Anyway, spread the word. Come find the wandering hide-and-seek Koopa. See you later, or not. Yours, Koopook. That was the guy that we found um, in Hooktail Castle. Alright, so, as I decided before, since I want to do all of the troubles and go through the Pit of 100 Trials at some point, um, I, so that they're not overwhelming, I want to do all of the troubles after each chapter the ones that unlock after each chapter so like as you can see we have three three new ones so we're gonna do these so that's gonna be my next plan and then we'll move on with the story um yeah after each chapter um i think i'm probably gonna go until 
12.15 or 12.30. So we still have a little bit to go. Um, okay. <clears throat> I'm getting up there in years. So I want me some insurance. A life shroom. I'm in no big hurry, but sometime before my time comes would be nice. Please meet me in the great tree in Bogley Woods. The pit of a hundred trials is what it's called. Yes. Do it and do it right. Alright, so we're going back to the puny elder. Oh, you know what? While I'm here, very dramatic for a May Mayro game. <laughs> it is quite dramatic for a Mayro game. <clears throat> Alright, we're gonna power up Coops. Oh, we can power up both of them! Sweet! We're gonna do that then. Shall I power up this partner? <laughs> it's in a pit, and each pit has a trial, and there are a hundred of them. <laughs> Shaw Zibby! Shaw Zubi! <laughs> It's also a lie. Every 10 floors isn't even a trial. Not that I'm complaining. That's true. It should be like a pit of 100 levels that also has lots of trials, but that's kind of a mouthful. Yes, I want to power up more. Okay, Coops is up, and then Flurry. Shaw Zippy! Pit of 90 trials. Shaw Zubi! Sounds like another one of Bowser's nasty tricks. I mean, it basically is. I'm sure Bowser's totally responsible. Then you may go! Cool, thanks. Alright. I'm gonna actually switch to Coops because a lot of the uh, uh, Boggly Woods um Creatures, if you will, um, are bad to jump on. <clears throat> pit of 100 levels that also has lots of trials, but that's kind of a mouthful, is the new name for the Pit of 100 trials. Exactly. titles. Aw, oh, yeah. Alright. I'm glad we got to come back here and see the beauty one more time. <laughs> Which, we'll come back here a couple times for side questy stuff, but... Yes! Nice! Let's switch. Get him out of the way. Peach better not text again while you're enjoying Bogglywood music, right? Yeah. <clears throat> See, like, the, the second time you go through an area, you just hardly get any star points, which is kind of a shame. Which makes grinding in this game pretty difficult. Which is why I always recommend just like battle the first time you go through a level or like first time you go through an area, just get as many enemies as you can. Even if it kind of slows down your progress because, whoa. Exactly. It, as long as you're battling enemies decent, like you're not avoiding enemies, then you're, there's really no reason to grind. Haha! -ha! Ha-ha! Take that! <clears throat> money! Money, money, money! Bye-bye! He's just, like, hanging out back there. Ooh. 
this game is just so perfectly created, in my opinion. They give you exactly the amount of enemies that you need in order to be um, on par with the rest of the game. I saw how you brutally wrecked his friend and he was not having none of that. Oh, is that you, Mardio? Are you here to listen to me pontif pontificate for a spell? Or did you bring me a life shroom? I have one. Here you go. Oh, glory. You got one. A life shroom. Lovely. Thank you, Martio. And you made it before I actually needed it. Whew. Here, take this reward. A life shroom is like health insurance. I'll live a long life now for certain. Sweet. I was going to say, dang, I'm sad she uh, took my life shroom, but 60 coins. I can buy, like, four of them for that. Okay, cool. Trouble done. Back we go. So, how are you guys doing? Um, any fun weekend plans for anybody this weekend? Are we having a relaxing weekend? Are we having a busy weekend? Hopefully we're having a good weekend no matter what we doing, we're doing. Tell, tell me about you, about you guys' weekends. How, what, how's life? What's new with y'all? While well, I'm just doing some of days. Ugh. Boom. Shell shield is going to be useful coming up. Alrighty, alrighty. <clears throat> I really don't like running from fights unless there's like four or five enemies on the screen. And then I'm like, ugh. My weekend features six fun hours of misery. Do you mean like, like workout? Maybe, yeah. I'll just kill fun or something, I guess. I mean, whatever gives you a fulfilling weekend, right? My week is going to be moving furniture because the maintenance man is going to fix our ceiling in the kitchen and the washroom, where the washer dryer's at. Well, it's bleh that you got to move furniture, but I guess it's good that you're getting everything fixed, right? It's like the work will be worth it kind of thing. It isn't fulfilling. It just happens. Me killing fun. I don't agree. La, la, la. We're going back to the trouble center. You think my killing fun is fulfilling? No, I, I think that you killing fun doesn't just happen because you don't kill fun. And that's how that works. Alright, 
next trouble. Let's go. Sometimes walking through bars is difficult. No, I'm singing beca out because you said the word misery and it made me think of it. <laughs> Lala. The Pianta Parlor is now having its grand opening event. Wee! Whoever takes this request gets something special from Lala, the cute kitty boo. We're waiting on Rogueport's west side, so please come quickly. Smooch! I don't know how this is a trouble, but okay. I guess we're going to the Pianta Parlor. This thing on this guy's head. Is that a hat or is that his hair? That green stuff. Some things about the Mario universe will continue to be a mystery to me. Oh! We need the next part of the story. Hey there, I'm Bluey. And this guy's a total liar. Don't listen to him. You heard his story, right? Well, he did try to throw me, but he completely tripped. And what happens? I end up landing in lava. Lava, man! You think that feels good? Thanks to him, you can stick a fork in me. I'm well done. My pale skin's crispified. I'll never forgive this guy. I'm gonna make him pay if it takes my whole lifetime. That's the only reason I'm still hanging around with him. You'll pay, Luigi! I'd guess hat. The only problem is that my grandmother has a huge china cabinet and it's heavy. Ugh. I guess you're gonna have to take all the china out, move the cabinet, and then put all, it ba put all of it back in. That's just, I know it's gonna be a lot. Well, I went to Rumble Bump Volcano and got myself a marvelous compass piece. It was an incredible quest. There was danger and all sorts of adventuring. It's pretty nuts, so bro. Wanna hear what happened? It's a pretty long story. Yes. Hey, sounds good to me. Which part of my story you wanna hear, bro? Tell me about Rumble Bump Volcano. Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here goes. As soon as my ship docked on the Pudding Continent, I set out for the volcano. To reach my destination, I spent several days fording through dense jungle. Scary beasts were all over. More than once I thought I was done for, bro. I may have screamed a bit to scare them off, you know, but as fate would have it, a blooper named Bluey heard me shrieking and found me in this one town. Bluey was on a journey of his own, but he joined me after hearing my tale. Now Bluey's a madman. Back in his hometown, they call him White Torpedo. Yeah, he's a tough guy. Anyway, he helped me fight to Rumble Bump Volcano. The place was all about bubble... The place was all about bubbling lava pools and heat that make the sun sweat. And the place was lousy with evil traps designed to protect the compass piece. The scariest one of all was this gigantic 100 foot tall statue that stomped around. Now the weakness of this giant statue bro was a red gem on its forehead. Now I can jump high but not high enough to reach this thing by a long shot. So I came up with this plan for Bluey to hit that weak spot. All you man, I said. I waited for a pause in the statue's movements and I hucked Bluey up there. And Bullseye, the white torpedo, saved the day. That jewel got whacked. It was a critical hit and the stone statue toppled and crumbled into pieces. Once that was done, it was an easy stroll to the room where the treasure was. Unfortunately, Princess Eclair was nowhere to be found. But I got another piece of the marvelous compass and put it in the base. Now the compass pointed west to Pump Plump Belly Village on the Strudel Continent. So I set sails once again and came back here to Rogueport to recharge. That's what happened to me lately, but I'll be heading back out soon. Okay. If you want to hear what I've been up to, just come find me, okay? I'll be around. We need Paper Luigi in the Marvelous Compass. It's true. It's true, we do. Okay. What's going on over here? Ex-nuts terrorizing Boggly Woods have withdrawn. Just what was their motive? Who knows? Alright. To the... To the Pianta Parlor. Hi! Hello there, Mario! Welcome to the parlor! Oh, you took all my trouble! That is so super! Well, okay, here's your special thing! Hee <laughs> hee, don't tell anybody! Hey, what's the matter? You look disappointed. Well, fine, whatever. Enjoy the parlor. Play and win. You solved the trouble. So you literally just had to come here and talk to her and get piantas? Like pianta coins or whatever? 
I'll hold Tim Piantis for you, Mario. Cool. Thanks. At least I didn't have to, like, go all the way to the bottom of the Bogley tree for basically no prize. Did you want a harder trouble? No, not really. I, I, it's just, you know. I know they, like, mix them up and they give you harder ones in between, like, easier ones, so I'm not complaining. Especially because some of the ones in the later game are going to take, like, forever to backtrack and get. Help my daddy. Oh, my dad's in a world of hurt down there. Please, you gotta help him. I'm waiting at the entrance to the pit of a hundred trials. He fell in the pit. We all fell in the pit. We all fall in the pit. In the pit. He fell in the pit. I'm about to see um, how many uh, levels down this guy is. <laughs> 10 down. 18. He's on the 18th level. Pine T. Jr.'s father's descended into the pit of hundred trials. Fight your way to level 18 and revive him. At level 20, you can warp back to the top. Well, I made my decision. I can't back down now. I guess we're going 20 levels into the pit of hundred trials right now. I fell into a burning ring of fire. I went down, 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 but these trials went farther. And it burns, burns, burns. The pit of trials. Yeah, we're doing it. Johnny Cash! Alright, here we go. I'm wondering if I should grab a couple items. I feel like I probably should. <clears throat> That's fine. It may be a good place to call it when I'm done with that trouble. We'll see. Man, I sing a lot. Let's do a fire flower. And a mushroom. You to fight, master. Yeah, it's true. I'm just, like, I look at that number, 146, and I'm like, whew! Okay. Here's we go. That's probably why they gave me two pretty dang easy troubles. Like, it was literally like, come talk to me. Um, which I did have to give a life shroom to the puny elder, but I already had one, so it was okay. But, uh, yep. And then they give you the one that's like, literally go talk to somebody in the town you're already in. And it's like, oh, and we're gonna give you this one. Oh boy, yeah. It's okay. We're just gonna go 20 levels deep and then call it probably there. And then we'll be able to pick up next stream with uh, making our way to the next place. Bloop. Making our way down. Oh. Making our way to the Glitzville. Whoop. Cool. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna save right here. So that if anything happens, I don't have to go far.
Here we go. <clears throat> I have to actually go to 20 because I can't warp back until I get to the 20th level. You took on my trouble? Oh, thank the stars. This is just terrible. My dad went into the pit of 100 trials and he never came out. He lost his job and said the only way to support us was the pit's treasure. But I don't need the treasure. I just want my dad back. Please help him. Enter. Oh boy. Two of those fours aren't trials. Oh, that's true. Glitzville's your favorite place in the game? Aw. Great. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, these guys already? Hmm. Let's do a spin jump. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Thank you. Thank you for believing. The one crappy place, the one, probably the, cra oh, shoot. I only have one. I only have one flower point. Well, at least they're giving me items, because that's cool. But I definitely did not. <laughs> I should have, like, slept in the inn, and I didn't even think about it. Oh, boy. Challenge mode, indeed. Whoop. Oh, buddy. So I don't even have... I don't even have the, uh... Means to, uh... Loop. This is basically Nuzlocke mode for this. Um, hmm. I don't want to waste all of my flower points. I should have jumped on that guy. What am I doing? warps in certain floors that will get down faster. Warps? Okay. Level two. Need this flower point. look around the rooms. Okay. Oh, fuzzies. Oh, man. Cool. Yeah, you only get one star point for, like, every level, so... Eek! The fuzzies are definitely the bigger threat here. Ah, 
Oh, dang it. That could have been the end, but, you know. Who tries to throw a rock when people are fighting? How rude, Crowd Goomba, right? Okay. Hmm. You're thinking about that puny who you can pay to warp? Hmm. That Goomba a punk. Dang it! Cool. Bye bye was an easier one. Nah, nah, nah. What, that was four? The most difficult part has been uh, trying to get into the fight. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good uh, suggestion, Tara. Thank you. Money. Yeah. Nice. First strikes really, really, really like count. They really do. It's literally a free turn. Try to get the first strike every time, but gosh darn. We're going to use that same strat. Mario hack that was mentioned recently where all the dialogue was re- yes, um, Book of Mario something something. Awesome is replaced with adorable! <laughs> option is probably still to power shell here. <laughs> Adorable! <laughs> we won! I'm a slam on my hammer and if you get hurt it's your own fault. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to walk into this? Sure you do. Back, 
Ha ha ha! Welcome back. How you doing? Had to do doggo things. Oh, okay. Hope doggos are good. Where am I? Level nine. All right. What we get? Sleepy stomp. Return to entrance. Doggo is not without water anymore. That is good. Water is a, a crucial part to living. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. John Awakens. Hope you're having a great Saturday. Oh. Neat. <laughs> um. No, I don't want to waste. Ugh. Yes, I do. Ugh. Dang it. Day at work, John Awakens. Shall I call you John? So I just got all my flower points. <laughs> nice. Got him. matter. Dang, what a not fun thing to awaken to. Alright! Did pretty good there. Got him. Bloop. 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 Got it. See, I'm getting all warmed up now. Steering wheel from Wally? -E? I haven't seen that movie in so long, so I have no idea what you're talking about. I did kill it. Auto? Yeah, I don't remember this at all. Hi, new enemy. I look. Oh! 
I forget. Everything's fine. <sighs> I'm getting kind of warm. How many more do I got? Six? Free touring. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you. That would be helpful. Dang it. My timing is off. You like the challenge? Not exactly. Poop. It's okay, we're fine. We're pretending that you do. Living on to age. gotta get into the let's do I do live on the edge when I use the animals crushers what is that Getting so hungry. So hungry. Dang it. Easy clap. I have to do them in two turns anyway, so I might as well just not spend. The animals crushers was this yogurt cup you would crush to get the yogurt out. Like a, like a go-gurt? Are we thinking of the same thing? Ah! Except in a cup. It was a bad product. Oh. Sweaty and I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. 
Got him. It's just describing me all the time. Except you don't, you like forget to eat and stuff. This is not good. Hence why I'm hungry. True. Dang it. Okay, cool. Whoa, I actually got like decent star points for that. I'm not keeping track. What level am I on? Why? You can eat while watching. 17. All right. Let's kill this guy, and then we'll go check on that guy. Not a multitasking pro like you. Sure you are. have to use a mushroom here in a second. I forgot to blink while I'm streaming. I'll fly over there and bake you some mac and cheese if I have to. Uh, can you just do that anyway? That'd be fun. Got him. Right? This guy. Huh? What? Who are you? Ah! Wow! Did you come here just to save me? Really? Pine T Jr.? Wow, good. I have to get back alive. Show me the way out. Let's go. That would be so fun. Dang it. is fine. We got this. Google, how do I make mac and cheese? Same. You get one of those craft boxes. <laughs> Follow the directions. I'm like really warm and really hungry. Kind of not feeling well. But it's probably because I'm sweaty and hungry. Hey, the exit! Okay, Pine T Jr., I'm on my way home. That's true. Fire Drive! That sounds like a great badge. Hey, 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 yo, I got all the hottest new products right here. Look no further. You got the fevered look of a man with a mind for goods. Want to buy something? Let's see what he's got. Oh, man, he is highway robbery over here. Highway robbery. My dad's back. Sorry for troubling you. I guess my health and family really are the most important things, you know? I'll look for new work. I've got to be strong for my dear son. Thank you so, so much. I'll give you my treasure as a reward. It's really important to me, but nothing's more important than my dad, so here. 
Silver card, a parlor card that lets you play the paper mode game. Cool. Hey, a rocks, you caught the end here. <laughs> Get out of there, don't want you getting sick. Yeah. I'm almost done here. You solved the trouble. Cool. All right, I think I'm gonna save right here and call it. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. Sorry that you caught pretty much the end here, A Rocks. Um, I hope you guys had a great day hanging out with me. It's always great to play Paper Mario, and I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Please enjoy your Saturday and the rest of your weekend. I will be back Monday night, I think, for a read stream, so I'll see you guys then. Please take care of yourselves, and as always, until I see you again, much love from me to you. I'll catch y'all soon. Bye!